Welcome to the tutorial on how to configure the administrative display options in NotePager Pro. The first step is to run the program, so find the icon on your desktop and double click on it. When the program comes up, if you're using the trial version, you'll see this prompt. If you would like to purchase the program, left click on the register button, then left click on the secure online ordering button. If you have already purchased, please click on the Enter Registration Information button and watch our NotePager Pro registration tutorial. If you would like to continue to use the trial version, left click on the Continue button. Once in the program, go to Tools, Settings, Display. In the Display Setup screen, you should see these options. The first two are Comment 1 and Comment 2 labels. If you want to change the labels attached to the comments that you may have added to your recipients and groups, enter them here. Next is Max Message Length. This identifies the maximum number of characters you would like your users to be able to enter in a single message from NotePager Pro. By default, this is set to 2000. Next is Remove Preset Buttons. If this is enabled, the preset message buttons and the ability to program the preset message buttons will be removed from the interface. Next is the Remove Options button. If this is enabled, the Options button and the ability to schedule messages will be removed from the interface. Next is Remove Logs. If this is enabled, the ability to view the connection monitor and the dialer log will be removed from the interface. Next is Remove Reports. If this is enabled, the ability to run reports will be removed from the interface. Next is Small Recipient Font. If this is enabled, the font in the recipient list and the selected recipient list will be much smaller. Next is Failure Warning Pop-up. If this is enabled, any time a message fails, a pop-up window will warn the user that the message has failed. Next is Clear on Send. If this is enabled, each time the user clicks on the Send button to send a message, the program will automatically clear the message and selected recipients. Below that is Display Group Label. You can choose if you want the parenthetical G that signifies a group to appear before or after your group's names. Last we have Minimize To. You can choose whether you want the program to minimize to the taskbar with the other applications or to the system tray next to the clock in Windows. After setting your preferences, left click on Apply. This concludes the tutorial on how to configure the administrative display options in NotePager Pro. For more tutorials, including how to configure the security options in NotePager Pro, please visit our website www.notepage.net.